right, welcome back. Happy Tuesday. About like about 48 hours away, about less than 48 hours away from the first game of the AFL Finals match. So, you know, last week or so, I gave you guys my like my first round preview. I didn't really give you guys my full preview, but I got I got some changes. I did some I did some research. I did some studying. I looked at like, some ups and downs, some statistics. Now I didn't write all of them down, but I changed my prediction. I changed my prediction. So this is my complete finals prediction for for, for the uh, full thing. You guys, let me know who you guys got in the comments below. Um, if it changed, is you know, eight weeks go by, everything's changed. But um, I think I did say I had Conway win the whole thing. I know, Chaz the hater has Conway win the whole thing. Chaz hates Collingwood. I don't. <laughs> but let's go ahead and get into it. I mean, hopefully, like I said, doing good. I mean, don't forget to like the, like the video and stuff as well. I'm going to be on my phone because I did have some stuff on my phone. But let's go get started with it, man. Oh, also, the stream schedule for this round. Let me just pull it up right quick. Add it on my notes. But anyway, obviously, Thursday. Well, my time Thursday morning at 5:20 a.m. Brisbane play Richmond. I uh, should gonna be live for that. I'm gonna be live for that. That's. I'm gonna be live for that. I got to. Last time Brisbane played Richmond, they lost. Um, so, gonna be looking forward to that Friday. Friday morning, Sydney versus Melbourne. I'm not too sure. So just be on the lookout for that. But I'm not too sure about that Friday. But the Saturday games, we should be good to go. So the only game on probably one stream is just the Sydney Swans Melbourne game, which is going to be a very very good game, in the qualifying finals. But besides that, we should be good for the rest of the games. Um, so being but just be on the lookout. Make sure you got my notifications turned on. Now let's get started with the video, man. So let's go ahead and get into it, man. Qualifying final one. We got Jalon, who are a very good point turnover differential. I think they first lot turnovers going against Collingwood, who you know led by Jack Given. But a good defensive team as well. Just an overall good team in general. Both teams are hot. Obviously, Collingwood has lost. I think their last game or two games. The, the, the last five games are like four and one. Obviously, Geelong has just been just winning games a lot. I think they won like twelve straight at one point. I think they're still in that streak. Um, I might go with Geelong winning, which puts them all obviously in the pre preliminary final, while. Collingwood, since they didn't make the top four, they get a extra game. So, and I actually like that rule because if you've made a top four, you deserve to have an extra chance. It's the top eight, and the bottom, the top bottom four, and the top four are, teams are solid. The bottom eight teams, that's where you deserve to be at. So, I like that rule. The uh, extra chance rules, especially for teams who you know who have, who have the bad record and stuff like that, it's not fair for them to lose after one game. But uh, like I said, I got Geelong beating them in the preliminary. Colin O um, still playing. Then you got Frio versus Western Bulldogs again. Western Bulldogs just got in at that A spot. Congratulations to Carlton for absolutely crapping the bed. Saint Kilda kind of collapsed as well, but very, but really, really Carlton, who was in like the top eight damn near all season, is out. So, uh, sucks for them, sucks for them, but uh, just a bad way from the end of the season, man. Um, I got Frio being West Bulldogs, so I, I just think West Bulldogs did just enough. Last fight, a couple games, they've been, you know, so so. I got Frio beating Western Bulldogs going against uh, Conway. We'll get to that game. <sighs> Brisbane versus Richmond, man. Uh, also, I think, I think Brisbane got like two players either suspended or injured. Um, yes, you guys, you guys are probably asking why this is up here. I was looking at it earlier, and I decided to just leave it up there, um, just to show you guys what some stuff I read. Um, but I got Brisbane getting right with, with, with Richmond, knocking them out. Um, I got the Lions getting right. I need them to get right. Okay. Last year, they came up short in, in, in the year before that as well. This is a very talented team, but the team is just inconsistent. 
and it's it's an inconsistent team. At times they look good, like they did against Carlton, but there's times they look bad, like they did against Melbourne. So just g- games like that, you know. This is my team. I hope that they win, man. But I got them being Richmond for right now. Then you have Melbourne versus Sydney. Uh, what about Buddy Franklin and the boys, man? Very good offensive team they are. Uh, going against Melbourne. Remember, it's the season undefeated. And then they kind of, you know, eh, eh. Wait in the water. Got Tila Teller, you know what I mean? Just a little bit shaky. Uh, but I I don't see him repeating. I don't see him repeating. Honestly, I think the last time that, that they played, Sydney beat him. So I'm going to stick with that. And finals, finals can go either way. I mean, you never know what the playoffs finals can be in any type of sport. But I got Sydney beat Melbourne, which gives him an extra chance. Going as Brisbane, and this is where it, it, it gets real interesting. So, semifinals we have Conway versus Frio. I do got the Pies beating Frio with a chance to go against the Sydney Swans. That should be very, very interesting. And then I got the Demons being Brisbane. I know, I know, I don't want to be biased because if I wanted to, I, I'll just have Lions to win. Or I say, oh, yes, it's a potential upset. You know, hopefully, Lions can get right against Melbourne. But remember, both their games against Melbourne this year, they got absolutely schmacked. The Lions. Because I know. That's my team. So, they got schmacked twice by them. I'm not really... And I, and I think third time, they may not get schmacked. They may not get smacked by them. But they're probably going to lose. So, fortunately, I got that, man. Which basically gives me the top four teams. Basically, what everybody predicts. You know, figures. I would love for Brisbane to beat Melbourne. I just don't see it. Especially from, from the regular season. Next, we have Geelong versus Melbourne. Can the Melbourne get? Can the Demons get back? I'm not sure. I'm just very high on the Cats, man. I do think the Cats will do it, and that's that. I just think they're gonna beat the Demons. Sydney, can Buddy get back to the grand final and win one, man? Going against the Pies. I know my last prediction, the first round. I did say. You know, if when they go back, I dab Conway would be in. Win, I mean, win the whole thing. You can go back there way to look at it. Um, can it change? Yeah, it can al- always change. You know, everybody's, everybody's mindset changes from week to week. So that's what I'm doing. I think Blaze is going to go back and do it. I think Blaze is going to go back and do it. Actually, no, I don't. I got Conway going against Joe Hawkins. <laughs> I think the Pies will get back. Which leads to a very, very big final. Um, you know, Buddy broke records this year. Obviously, the 1,000 goal record this year. But I just got the Pies. Also, I think the Pies want Geelong. I think that they do. Um, cause I think, if I'm correct, Geelong beat. Geelong beat uh, Collingwood the last time they played. But it was a close game, though. But, but to end it off... I know, you know, the best record, man. I got Chulong winning the whole thing. I changed my mind. I still I still have to call him making to the finals. But I got Chulong winning the whole thing. But that's pretty much it. That's my preview, prediction, man, whatever you want to call it. Hope you guys enjoy it. Don't forget to like it. Sub. You guys leave, leave you guys thoughts, man. You guys feeling into the finals. Stay safe. See you guys later. Peace.